Hey guys, it's Mike. We are back with a quick look at the Pop and Tea combo for the Box Lunch exclusive Venomars Thanos. That is a mouthful. But yeah, we picked this up today. Uh, I wanted to take a quick look at it, and it's a pretty neat looking design. Like, the design on the box is phenomenal. I almost wish they would have done a separate pop of that because it looks amazing. But let's take a look at it. Alright, we've got the shirt as always. This one is a little different because there's actually a design on both sides of the shirt. Now the front, the front just has the little Thanos head, which in the picture I thought was a pocket, but I was like, no way. Funko's not spending that kind of money on a pocket t-shirt. <laughs> but no, it's just a little Thanos head, but the main design is on the back. Which again is that picture from the box, which looks great. You know, it's got Thanos, he's Venomized, he's got the gauntlet on, he's on a Venomized, like, throne. This shirt is sick. Might be one of my favorite uh, Funko shirts they've done in a long time. But yeah, I like it a lot. So, excited to throw that on soon. Probably wear the hell out of it, as long as it doesn't shrink. But, yeah, now let's take a look at the pop. Alright, now it is the same mold as the common, which is, that's fine. But it is a glow-in-the-dark version, so we're going to take a look at the glow. Alright, here is the Thanos. Again, it's just the mold that is, you know, the regular mold that they did. We are charging it up with our black light flashlight we have here. We are going to take a look at this thing together. Getting a really good charge on it. Let's see here. Well, let's pop it off. Look at that glow. That white is sick. That is sick. Look at that. The flame. Look at the flame. Like, there was some misleading because in the picture they put online, it looked like the flame didn't glow. But... We can see it glowing. It looks phenomenal. This might be one of the best looking glow pops they've done. Uh, especially Marvel. Mm, a little more turn in the eyes. That looks great. I will say I wish, uh, I wish the tongue had some glow to it. That would have been a nice touch. But that's just me nitpicking. This pop looks phenomenal. And I am excited to add this to the collection. Um... Yeah, we are getting quite a few glow-in-the-dark pops here recently, and I am not mad. Look at that Thanos booty. Just kidding. Um, <laughs> look at that. All right. Well, let's wrap this up. Yeah, so the glow on this pop looks phenomenal. Like I said, it might be one of the best glows we have seen in a while probably rivaling the uh, the Human Torch we got from the Fantastic Four box, but this looks great. Uh, I mean, I love the common mold. I would have, I want to see them do one with him on that throne. That would be freaking great, but I just wish the tongue glowed. I mean, that wouldn't be too hard, right? Put some pink glow or something like that on his tongue. It just would look great, but that's just me nitpicking. Otherwise, this pop is phenomenal. I'm happy about it. The glow in the dark box lunch exclusive. And this shirt. Again, this shirt. Woo! It's beautiful. I'm probably going to wear it very soon and probably often. Um, but yeah, I like to see Funko do things differently instead of just slap a design on a shirt and then throw it in a box. So it's nice to see them take a little, little creativity with the pop, give it a nice little design, and I'm happy with it. So let me know in the comments below what you think about this pop, this tea, this combo. Um, you know, if you're new here, make sure you subscribe because we're trying to get more videos out. We're trying to get more content out, and I'm having fun doing it. It's been a blast. So yeah, <sighs> I guess that's it. We'll see you later.